Gemini, welcome to your weekly forecast, and this is for Feb 17th until 23rd. Now let's see what's going to be coming your way. Some Geminis will be preparing for their big day or prepare will be preparing for their wedding. And there will be a lot of things to do. But somehow there will be a fire sign who's a party pooper. And I feel like you're gonna have some slight issues into this. All right, this is going to be a very favorable week for you. Hmm, financially and career-wise. I feel like things will be really, really in favor of you. For some of you who is looking for a new job or f waiting for a new job offer or like a contract, you know, if you're also in a business, this is the week that you will get, you know, what you want and that you will be granted with the things that you feel like it should take place soon. And this is going to change the path of your career, you know. And um, and for some of you who is aiming for a higher position, you know, like a senior executive or could be higher than that, you know. Um, this is the week where those dreams will start taking place. Now, for some of you who is preparing for their big day or for their big wedding... It seems like there will be a, some slight issues, you know, that you're going to be encountering here and there. But all in all, you'll be very happy to do all of these things or, you know, to... And someone will also be throwing their tantrums, you know, just because that they can't get what they want. Now, they feel like they can, you know, like, um, m like manipulate you into getting what they want through this especially if you're marrying a fire sign you know anyway this person for some reason there will be some you know there are some things in the past that you have to clean up or this person needs to um sever their ties okay f with that person from the past they still keep on dipping back and forth and you know that the communications is still ongoing you need to come to a um, solution or you need to come into a resolution between the two of you that if ever the two of you will be making this official and formal, then both of you have to say goodbye to your past. Okay, especially that this person every time that something happens in your relationship or something, uh, you know, it, it's like every time that you're going to have some fights, arguments, issues. Uh, conflicts dramas as well this person keeps on getting in touch back with that person from the past and this has always been your problem now if you wanted to know if, if this will can you know continuously go on like this i feel like it yeah because it's all the behavior and pattern of this person that they have to keep the triangulation um active okay so that just in case that the, the present won't actually work out for them or it won't be in favor of them, they will have something to fall back on. Okay, and you need to open up your eyes and you need to open up your mind about this. Instead of, uh, you know, like being in denial or paranoid about it, think more of a solution. Okay, because it's so hard when the trust is already gone and when your foundation has been, you know, crumbling down slowly a bit. So... I feel like you just need to be a little bit more, you know, um, persuasive and put your foot down. Since that you, especially if you are the man in the relationship, you need to set some rules, okay? And don't tolerate this kind of behavior because this will become more of a pattern in your relationship and it will always be a pertaining issue, okay? Now... 
you will also have some issues with a few of your friends being unavailable okay during this week and uh, I feel like you're starting to think that why is it that they are you know slowly moving away some of them are not really in favor of the person that you're going to be getting involved with officially and I feel like you are you know yeah, you're going to be a little bit disappointed that why can't they just be happy for you now you you know someone will actually uh, like relate to you like how do they really feel about this situation and that they don't really you know feel so positive that this whole thing will last it will become a challenge for you but you know what you also have to <clears throat> you also have to start considering why is it that some people can see some things that you can't or why is it that you can't see you know like uh, their perspective and where do they you know where are they coming from now instead of being so negative about it why don't you try to you know look into a different angle take a few steps back and try to place yourself okay into their place or try to step onto their shoes to see that maybe that there is a small flaw or there is something that they could see that you're not and that you're being blindsided okay so instead of being in denial try to be a little bit more open-minded because this is also for your own good you know ah, marriage is really costly you know going through the weddings and stuff like that the reception and then all of a sudden after a few months or a few years you're gonna be filing for a divorce so take a few steps back and um, I feel like um, instead of withdrawing try to think of more ways on how to resolve this because you can okay because you're very you know you're born to be smart and you know like you're very analytic and um, you're also sharp observant okay and you know to yourself that there are some things about this fire sign person you know especially if this is the one that you're with that this person has something in them that's not really you know acceptable or especially a behavior that that is not really acceptable in the eyes of many all right so try to understand where they're coming from and don't really reject other people's opinions towards your situation because it's not really going to help you at all and your finances you don't really have to take a loan if this is what you're trying to do but some of you if you want to file for any remortgaging or uh, you know uh go for or try to get approved for a new house new loan new car you know something like that everything will be very easy and smooth for you this week or if there is like a transaction or sale okay that you're also trying to make it will be this week will be a very very favorable week for you so go for it all right money will come easily for you this week and uh, you know you just need to deal with the some other people's dramas okay towards your situation but try to understand first where they're coming from okay instead of um, pushing it away all right anyway that's it for you for this week um, Gemini, if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.